I have this pumpkin I picked up at Hobby Lobby for $9.99, 40% off. And I'm removing the jute top hanger and painting it with saffron thread by Wise Owl. And I'm using a foam roller. You can paint the back of your pumpkin for time purposes. I'm going to not do that, but you can most certainly finish the back. Allowing this to dry, I then took this lace runner, also from Hobby Lobby, for $3.60 on sale. And it didn't cover the whole pumpkin, so I decided to go with that scalloped edge at the top and allow it to show. Using joint compound, right from the hardware store and a dollar store uh, spackle knife. I'm adding the joint compound all over my lace. You kind of want to add it on thick and then gently lift the excess up because um, you just want don't want to shift your lace. So you want to be gentle about it. And I'm trying to get it up in that scalloped area as neat as I can. Now you can immediately put your uh, runner in a soapy water bucket and I just rinsed mine with the garden hose and I was able to reuse it again. And you just want to gently lift up your lace runner. And it just leaves the imprint behind. I just love this craft. I've done them before. I'm sure some of you have seen it. Now I'm going to take my heavy metal. This is our Cleopatra Gold by Wise Owl. And I'm going to cover that top portion. I only did one coat and you can still kind of see the orange peeking through. I found the sunflower at Hobby Lobby. Their seasonals are all 40% off. I think it looks cute just with the simple sunflower, but I decided to add um, a little bow behind it and I'm starting with some uh, burnt orange burlap and a couple pieces of some ribbon that I picked up at the Dollar Tree that I felt matched. And just using a piece of jute, I tied it all together. And I decided to just stagger it to the side so you could still see the pumpkin stem. Using some hot glue, I attached my bow. And I found this little spray of um, thin, long, like ferns. And I took a couple pieces and added that to my bow just to hang down. and then added the sunflower. Very simple, I think it came out really pretty. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now find our videos at chalkitupfancy.com. For paint products or brushes, chalkitupfancy.com. Thank you so much.